The core test. Why don't they have a fitness assessment to assess your core strength and stability? I'm giving it to you. Go on my website, c2coreconcepts.com. You can go on the website and you can find out if you have a strong core. There's a lot of you out there doing abs all day. Hey man, I do 800 sit-ups all day and you do the core test and you fail. You know why you fail? Because the core test does not assess your ab strength. It's your entire core, your abs, obliques, back and glutes. So go on the website, do my videos, keep going back every two or three weeks just to see if you are making progress, okay? Uh, if you're someone who hasn't completed it properly, uh, if you're coming out of position in this core test, you fail. So I want you to pass it. Go on my website. The core test consists of six stages and it lasts for two minutes long. The proper form for a plank, it's pretty simple. The elbows are shoulder width apart, the head is positioned forward, the legs should be placed together with the hips in a flat position. If you would like to know how flat your back should be, I want you to picture having a dinner plate on your lower back and if it falls off while conducting this test, then you have compromised your form in some way. If your hips come up or sway from side to side, you've also come out of proper plank position. Lift your right arm off the ground. Let's hold this position for 10 seconds. Return your right arm to the ground and lift the left arm off the ground. Also hold this position for 10 seconds. Return your left arm to the ground and lift your right leg off the ground. Hold this position for 10 seconds. Return your right leg to the ground and lift the left leg off the ground. Hold this position for 10 seconds. Lift your left leg and right arm off the ground. Hold this position for 10 seconds. Return your left leg and right arm to the ground. Lift your right leg and left arm off the ground. Hold this position for 10 seconds. Return to the basic plank position, elbows on the ground. Hold this position for 30 seconds. We're approaching the end of your core test. Make sure you're breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Our back is flat, head facing forward. Okay, that completes your core test. If you'd like to track your progress, come back to the website at c2coreconcepts.com every two to three weeks.